I don't think people understand that short videos and long videos have two different CPMs. Honestly, it's not just 10% or 20% difference. It's a huge difference. Let me show you. As an example, this cooking video has an RPM, which is revenue for 1,000 views of $1.25, and it's a good amount. But for this video, which is a short video in the same niche, has an RPM of $0.03. So if you do the math, let's say this short video gets 1 million views. The revenue is going to be around $30. Just imagine if you get the same amount of views for this long video, it's going to be around $1,250. So. I think now you understand the difference between RPM of short videos and normal videos. If you are planning to buy a Ferrari from a short video channel, it's kind of impossible. Don't get the wrong idea that short videos are completely useless. Actually, it's not. So, that's why I decided to make this video about short and long videos. If you watch this video till the end, you will have answers to all of your questions regarding this issue. Then you can decide whether to start a short channel or a long video channel. The first question a lot of my viewers have asked is, can we monetize a short video YouTube channel? The simple answer is, yes, you can monetize your short video channel. But before you even start, there are important factors you need to understand. With the power of AI, we can create or generate content without any limits. So YouTube now has some rules regarding this type of content. Let's discuss these rules one by one. If you really want to become a successful creator, watch this video till the end. You will get a lot of knowledge within the next few minutes. I will explain all the things that you should not do if you want to get monetization approved. These are the points that YouTube policy has clearly mentioned that you should not do. Let's talk about these one by one. The first one is that templated or programmatically generated content cannot be monetized. Let me explain the meaning of this. Templated videos are videos that have the same background and same music. The best example is this channel. Earlier this year, this channel was doing great. They got a lot of subscribers and millions of views, and they probably made a lot of money from this. But according to YouTube's new policy update, this channel has templated content, so it's no longer monetized. So what is the programmatically generated content? I know that you have seen lots of videos like this, where you can generate 1000s of short videos using the Canva bulk editing option. I have even made a channel with a similar type of content. And also I have posted tutorial videos to create videos like these in this channel. Unfortunately, these are no longer monetizable according to YouTube's new policy. Let's talk about the next point, which is channels with similar and repetitive content without any commentary or narrative. They are talking about channels like this, this channel has posted random videos, and I have seen similar videos like this all around the internet. Even though these videos have a lot of views, they are not monetizable. The third point is that you can't monetize the videos that have popular songs, or songs that have been modified from original songs. To be honest, this is not a new rule actually, so don't use other creators' songs on your videos, it's just as simple as that. The next point is that you cannot monetize the content that includes materials that you did not create such as text from books, websites, or news feeds. What this means is that you cannot directly use someone else's work and create a video using that. So if you use information like that, make sure to convert those into your own words and check the plagiarism, and then you can use it on your video. Finally, you cannot monetize videos with just images or slideshows with small commentary. The best example is this channel. Even though this channel has lots of views, it's no longer monetized. Almost every video has AI-generated images and slideshows. This channel was a huge success, but due to new YouTube monetization policies, this is no longer eligible for monetization. So now you have a clear idea about these policies. So don't do these things if you are planning to start. Always create unique content, even if you are using AI tools. So now let's think starting a short YouTube channel is a good idea or not. This is my opinion. If you want to make money fast, I would not recommend you to start with short videos because RPM is very low. But if you have patience and you want to build your audience fast, YouTube Shorts are the best way. With YouTube Shorts, you can get more subscribers with a few videos. But let me explain one of the most important things that a lot of new creators are not considering. If you are planning to start a channel with YouTube Shorts and get subscribers and then upload long videos hoping that they will get a lot of views, I'm sorry guys, it will not happen. The reason is that short videos and long videos have two different audiences. Some people like to watch short videos only. So if they subscribe to your channel and then you start to upload long videos, they will not watch it. 
only some percentage of your subscribers will watch it. So you will not get a lot of views from doing that. This process works only for a few niches, especially niches like motivation and cooking. If you do this to an educational channel, it will not work. That's why I don't upload short videos to this channel anymore. The problem with this issue is that the viewers who like to watch YouTube shorts are looking for quick satisfaction. Then they will scroll to the next video. This type of viewer has 30 second attention span. They will not spend eight to 10 minutes watching your long videos. So basically, if you do this, you attract two different audiences to your channel. Let me explain why this is bad for your channel. Let's say you got 100K subscribers from short videos. Then you upload a few long videos to the channel. If you get fewer views, the YouTube algorithm will think that your videos are useless and suck. Because even if you have 100K subscribers, they don't want to watch your video. Even if they watch, it will be probably around 30 seconds. This is really bad. Then YouTube will not recommend your videos to different audiences. So your channel will be like a dead channel. If you don't believe me, let me show you some examples. Zach Choi is one of the biggest YouTubers with 25 million subscribers. His niche is ASMR cooking niche. If you go to his channel, you can see his short videos have millions of views. He is probably getting billions of views per month from these shorts. But if you check his long video content, views are very low, not even close to 1 million. All videos have of around 100,000 views. With 24 million subscribers, it's a very small amount. The next example is Iman Gaji, who is also a very famous influencer. If you go to his channel, he has zero short videos. He doesn't make short video content for YouTube because his audience loves long videos. I hope you understand the difference between these two audience groups. That's why I don't recommend using both short and long videos on the same channel. So before you start your channel, you must do your research and find out which type of content is suitable for your audience and is it actually profitable and you need to be updated with new YouTube policies because when they change their policies and demonetize your channel, we cannot do anything about it. As I always say, YouTube is not an easy method to make passive income. To be honest, I thought that with the power of AI, YouTube is going to be an easy thing. But I was wrong. Your content must be unique and valuable. If you wanna make money from YouTube, you should not try easy methods. Even if you are going to use AI tools like I do, you need to put much effort into your videos. I normally edit one video for two days straight. Without this effort, I cannot provide quality and valuable content to my audience. If you wanna know how I got a lot of subscribers within just 75 days, watch this video. It's about creating a successful YouTube business within three months of time. With that said, I'm about to end this video. If you have any requests or questions, feel free to leave a comment. I will see you in the next video.